Hi, I'm Calvin Rowland, SVP of Business Development. We're here at Agility with F5 CEO, Francois Locodonou. Francois, thank you for taking some time. Thank you, Calvin. Thanks for having me. Shall we jump into it? Absolutely. Okay, mm -hmm. so the first thing I want to ask you about is, I've been hearing you talk about this concept of application capital. Mm -hmm. What is it that you mean when you talk about that? What I mean by that is there have been multiple ages in the world of capital over the years. There's been the age of machine capital, the age of human capital, and I think we've entered the age now of applications capital. And what I mean by that is the most valuable assets that an enterprise can own today are actually their applications. So when you've talked about that, I've also heard you talk about this insatiable appetite that mm. organizations have for more mm. and more applications. They're going to deploy mm. even more in 2018 than they've deployed in 2017. Mm -hmm. And we just started to take that on faith as true, mm. uh, but it, it begs the question, why is that true? What, which, what makes these applications so valuable that they've become this modern capital? as you describe it? Well, first of all, I, I think we're just in the infancy of this age of application capital. Yes, there are roughly 250 million uh, enterprise workloads out there today, but there will be billions of enterprise workloads out there in the next three to five years. So the reason there's this proliferation of applications is because they are now at the core of how enterprises create value. Applications forecast, they store data, they automate processes, et cetera. But the biggest reason applications are so important to modern enterprises is because they collapse the time it takes to create value for our customers. So the amount of time it takes for us to launch products, look at how our customers are responding to these products, uh, segment our customer responses, and then modify our product offerings as a result of that, which is something every company on the planet needs to do, with the right software applications, we're able to collapse that cycle from weeks or months to minutes or seconds. And that's a source of enormous value creation. So there are some implications with that, though. Um, as we have been saying in the marketplace, as you have said to the marketplace on multiple mm. occasions, you've talked about it here at Agility, mm. the way those applications are being deployed has changed. Mm -hmm. Increasingly now, they're deployed in this multi-cloud construct. Mm -hmm. And you have said that in that environment, it's the application that decides where it gets to reside mm -hmm. versus an IT organization overtly prescribing where it goes mm -hmm. as it historically was done. Mm -hmm. So you know, talk a little bit about that. What do you mean that the application gets to decide where it resides? What, what I mean by that is the, you know, uh, there is, w when you look at F5 serves you know, 20,000 plus enterprise customers around the world and every single one of our customers is going through some form of digital transformation. And as we study this digital transformation and we ask our customers where are their applications residing, we're finding that they're making decisions as to where these applications reside on a case-by-case -case basis. And, and for the most part, they're choosing the best cloud for each application. And the result of that is complexity, because you have applications now residing in public clouds, in private clouds, in on-premise, in, in, in the SaaS vendor environment, in co-location data centers. Uh, and that creates what we call at F5 the multi-cloud challenge, which is how do you, in this environment, uh, secure these applications, ensure visibility into uh, the health of the application, and ensure that the applications are performing uh, all the time. And that's really what we've, we've set out to address as a company. So, so related to that then, mm -hmm. Uh, organizations are deploying more applications to, mm -hmm. to run their businesses more effectively. Mm -hmm. They're deploying them in these multiple cloud uh, mm -hmm. constructs. For them to be able to get to the value that they're after though, mm -hmm. they need to address that complexity that you've described. The very thing they're pursuing creates the opportunity for complexity. So we have a role to play to help them overcome that complexity to get to that value. So maybe talk a little bit more about that. What are we doing to help them address that? Absolutely. Most, most businesses don't want to spend their precious time managing the complexity of how do I get con consistent security policy for my applications across all environment? How do I get consistent visibility into the health and performance of applications? And so there really is a role for a focus player uh, like us that understands applications, that understands security, uh, to really be able to take that complexity away from our customers. And that's essentially the, the vision that we've laid out for ourselves of, of being that multi-cloud application services partner uh, that enables our customers to deploy any application anywhere with the enterprise-grade services that they need and not have to worry about that 
complexity. That's pretty much what, what we're mission on as a company. We help them overcome that complexity. We give mm -hmm. them the confidence to move forward. Absolutely. Well, Francois, I don't often get to say this to you, but this is all the time that we have. We need to leave it right here. Thank you for your time. <laughs> Thank to you learn more them. about this, as well as F5's broader vision for multi-cloud application services, please visit f5.com. <laughs>